Hey everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name's Bryn. I hope you're all doing very well and I hope you had an amazing Easter. And today I have another candle haul, but this time it is not Bath and Body Works. It's actually Goose Creek. So Goose Creek has been killing it lately with all their collections that they've been putting out. They have been putting out some fun uh, collaborations and just some really fun collections that I have been just dying to get my hands on. So I placed a huge order and I got this ginormous box, which I'm going to set it right here. So I actually really like Goose Creek candles. My husband actually prefers them to Bath and Body Works, but, um, com Pairing them to Bath and Body Works, I would say they're very similar. On cold, sometimes it's hard to gauge the scent. You really have to burn them. And of course, you can't smell them before you purchase them, which is kind of sad. But I wish they had a store. That'd be amazing. I know they have been putting some of them into Walmart. So check that out if you want to smell them before you buy them. Um, but they have just been really releasing some amazing collections lately and Bath and Body Works has kind of been putting out the same old stuff so I don't know so I was excited to see all this stuff everything is spring and summer so I'm gonna share with you guys what I got so I have yet to receive a broken candle from Goose Creek. Recently, I received like one of my first broken candles from Bath and Body Works, but it was a nice experience. They replaced it right away. It was fine, but so the, the way they package it is they put in these like um, these things in there to like secure the candles. And they also gave me this little card that like announces their new Peter Rabbit collection, which is super cute. So there's that. Um, we're just gonna get into these candles. I have briefly smelled them, but we're just gonna like smell them again on camera. So let's get into it. So the first one in here is definitely my favorite package of this entire haul. It is the Cliffside Sea Spray. This is so absolutely stinking adorable. I love this. This like screams summer and there's a cute little turtle on there. So yeah, love this packaging. The scent is actually, oh, it's, it reminds me kind of, of a Bath and Body Works scent, obviously. It's kind of cologne, but it also it's just very, very aquatic. It's not really like you're going to the beach because you don't really smell that, um, like sand note, but it's almost like you're like at an aquarium and you just smell like the ocean breeze, like salt spray. I don't know. This one's really nice. So, but this is my favorite packaging of the entire haul. <laughs> so there's that. And then next up, and we'll go in that same collection, is the Honolulu Ice Cream, which again, the packaging is so gorgeous. This just makes me want to go on a tropical vacation. Like, I absolutely love this packaging. The scent, however, is kind of weird. I'm not going to lie. I'm not getting pineapple ice cream, like, at all. I do get the pineapple, but it's very plasticky. And I'm also getting like almost like a French baguette scent. Like if they mixed like one of the pineapple scents from Bath and Body Works mixed with French baguette and like very plasticky, that's what you get. <laughs> so I'm hoping this one burns better than it smells on cold, but this is so gorgeous, like to die for. So there's that summer collection. Maybe I should have done spring first. Sorry, but, um, next up is a candle that my husband actually picked out. I needed like an extra candle to get like the deal. So I had him pick one out. <coughs> Excuse me. 
and he chose boardwalk cone and obviously i'm thinking this one is gonna smell like a uh, berry waffle cone from bath and body works but let's see okay yeah it's very similar but i'm getting less of a berry note and less of that cinnamon and more just waffle cone there is a berry note in there but it's like heavy on the waffle cone it smells really good so there's that one and next up is this gorgeous i okay i wish i could have gotten this whole collection but i had to stop myself it is like this southern like front porch collection i don't know but this is so gorgeous i love the tree and first of all the um my label on here is very sideways and wonky but we're just not gonna talk about it because this is so absolutely just this is everything i love in a candle and the scent is it's pretty it kind of it's kind of giving like wet leaves like not mushy leaves but it's not crisp it's more like not like um there's like some dew on the leaves and it very much does smell like a willow tree i guess you could say but it also is giving like fresh cut grass so i love this the packaging on this the scent is not my favorite but it does kind of remind me of like a spring summer day so there's that one and then I guess we'll stick to that same collection. I did get three in that collection. So next up is Buttered Blueberry Scone. Doesn't that just look absolutely delicious? I don't know, like I just wanna be there. And I love the like checkered pattern. I don't know, I just love it. So <sighs> this one smells so good. It smells like I'm not really getting much of scone. I'm getting very like heavy, juicy blueberry. It just smells like the ripest blueberry you would ever smell in your life. And you just like bite into it and it just juices. That's what it smells like. And it's almost a little plasticky. It kind of reminds me of a Bath and Body Works blueberry. It kind of reminds me of blueberry marshmallow bar. If I could compare them. Yeah, this is, this smells very similar to blueberry marshmallow bar, but it's very, I'm not really getting much bakery. I'm just getting like a juicy, juicy blueberry. So there's that. And the packaging is so cute. And then next in that same collection, this is actually my favorite like scent of the whole haul and it's homemade cherry pie and actually the packaging is super cute like I just love that scene it's so it just like I want to sit on a front porch in like the south and just like sip on some tea and just people watch I don't know what I don't know what they do bird watch <laughs> but yeah this one smells really good too it just smells like cherry pie you know it's a little plasticky too <laughs> They are, they're all kind of like artificial smelling, you know, but I don't mind it. I honestly don't mind it, but yeah, there's homemade cherry pie. And then last up is all the spring ones that I got. And I have been wanting the strawberry shortcake collection for the longest time. It first launched and then it sold out really quick. They relaunched it and I've just been waiting for them to go on sale and they just never do. So the first one I got was Strawberry Shortcake Custard. And if you don't know who Custard is, it's this little cat. So cute. Um, let's see. Okay, yeah. This one is definitely like a creamy strawberry. It's almost like strawberry pound cake, but creamier. Because it has that custard note smells really good actually this one smells really bomb so <laughs> there's that one and then next up we have huckleberry pie 
Um, the packaging is not my favorite on this one. I don't really, the little hearts, mm, I could do without that, but. I want to eat huckleberry pie. Like, I want to, maybe I should bake a huckleberry pie. Like, where can you get huckleberry? I don't know. Not around here, I don't think. <laughs> um, I mean, it smells good. Does it smell like huckleberry? I don't know. <laughs> It kind of just smells like blueberry pie, but love that. And then the last one, you guys, is I'm probably ending on the worst one, but this is raspberry tart. I do actually love the packaging of this. I love raspberries, so that's just really cute. But the scent, um, okay, I don't know. I'm getting like a burnt crayon scent. I honestly think it's the lid. So we're just going to toss that aside and smell the actual candle. Okay, that smells better, but I don't know. Like, maybe it's supposed to smell like crayons because it's strawberry shortcake and, like, everything, like, smelled plasticky and, like, crayons in the 80s or whatever. <laughs> but... I don't know it smells better without this lid but it's kind of it I can't really smell it all that much but the like it just smells like crayons to me yeah so <laughs> that's it for my Goose Creek candle haul let me know if you guys like Goose Creek or if you've tried them and if you guys want me to do more hauls from them I'm thinking about filming like a top 10 candles from Goose Creek. So that might be fun. Um, but before I go, I just wanted to take a second to thank you guys for supporting my channel. It's been kind of rough, like a rough start with this channel. And I just want to grow and do more content and different things. And I, I just really want to grow my channel and I would be nowhere without you guys. I love your, that you guys are always watching and commenting and just supporting me. And that honestly, it means the world to me. I love each and every one of you and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye.